that amount is one of the largest ever in the state. For comparison, the Bozeman City Commission considered sending a $99 million project bond to voters for a recreation, aquatics, and library center. Going back earlier this year, Laurel looked to pass an $88 million school bond, but only half of that passed for improvements to the elementary school. And recently here in Billings, voters passed a $7.1 million safety levy in 2020, while the $1.5 million school levy was voted down last year. This is not what I would want for my family for a family bathroom. But despite the ask of this new bond, Mayor Bill Cole knows just how important it is, showing some of what is in need of repairs at the South Park Pool Building. It's our number one goal is to make sure the water is safe and the facility is clean. Because of this and other park buildings also in need of work, the mayor and his wife Ann are donating $500,000 to the private fundraising for the $143 million bond issue for a multi-use rec center, parks and trails. Ann and I love Billings and this is a way to give back. The Colds are passionate about park improvements and their contribution brings the total private donations to about half of the six million dollars required to start the projects. Kids deserve a um, great place to recreate. They thrive when they have activities. The potential six million in donations is dependent on the bond issue passing in November and even with the private money the city will ask for the full 143 million dollars. In theory it might be that there would be no private donations. We know that's not the case. We know there will be a, uh, many millions of dollars of private donations, but we have to assume the worst case scenario when we issue those bonds. But some are not as excited about the project, one that would add about $50 in taxes for every $100,000 of the home's value. The rec center is such a flagrant waste of money. Clark Johnson once served on the Parks Advisory Board. He says about $1 million of the bond will go to develop Cottonwood Park on 54th Street West, which he says is much less than the board believed was going to be allocated a few years ago. Johnson says he would have liked to see two separate bonds, $85 million for the rec center and $57 million for parks and trails. They took the money away from a nice family park in West Billings, Cottonwood Park, to put that money into the rec center. The mayor says a nine-page resolution would guarantee the city works on all projects, not just the rec center. That's the quality of life that makes us love Billings. In Billings, David J, MTN News.